Hello everyone. We're back to watch unboxings. <laughs> uh, hope you enjoyed the Spurs of Box unboxing. That's a little different. Uh, I figured I'd give that a shot, you know, whenever they show up. And I know I've, we've had a lot of watch unboxings recently. They're mostly from the same period of time uh, around the beginning of December, uh, mid-December too. Uh, because of uh, Black Friday shopping, I've spread them out. Uh, the dropping video, dropping the videos, because I know the the content needs to. I need to be putting out regular content uh, and not just bombarding everything at once, because then I'll have nothing to put on here. <laughs> anyway, I uh, just wanted to explain the consistency of all the watches showing up uh, this we have a watch gang unboxing here uh, this is from I believe this was a wheel this is a wheel watch I believe um, I think I know what it is but since I wasn't expecting its delivery today I'm gonna be surprised along with all of you although the title of the video will know will show what it is but before i begin i wanted to do a wrist check i'm wearing the citizen diver i unboxed uh a little while ago a few, a few weeks ago probably or a week ago i don't remember how exactly the videos are being released and i put it on a nato as you saw uh I, i'm not particularly a fan of rubber or uh silicone uh, wrists, bands. So switch it up to NATO. I think it looks nice. All right. So this box is open now. Let me put away the knife and let's see what we have here. Paper for now. All right. I'm hoping it is. Should be the Spinnaker Hunley. All right, so let's take a look. My brother really likes my older brother, who now has a watch collection of his own, and who actually probably loves watches a lot more than I do. Uh, loves this brand, Spinnaker. All right. Yeah, this is the 5080 Spinnaker Hunley. Alright, 5080. What is this? It's a new Spinnaker brand logo? I, did, I didn't know they changed their logo. Okay. Here's the Hunley. That looks pretty nice, actually. What do you think? No, it's a little different with the color scheme, but I kind of like it. It's a little purpley, but it's fine. I'm a lot more colorful with my watches than I normally am with any other type of clothing. For reference, just look at the orange Seiko I got. Uh, unboxed recently. Wait, wait, wait. Ah, this is a lot of plastic. And you guys know I don't like plastic that much on the watches. All right. Well, okay. Let's remove the tag here. For all you buying watches, if you're not sure about a watch, I'm, I, even if I am sure about a watch, always keep the tag information. Always keep try to keep the boxes as well. Uh, if you ever need to sell the watch, having the tags, having the box, having everything just makes every, everyone's life easier. Just everyone's life easier. OK. 
Okay. That's... Yeah. I'm wondering if next time I should just stop, uh, pause the video before I get to the uh, removing of plastic portion of this. So there we are. What do you think? I kind of like the red and the neat, and you can tell the uh, loom on this thing. Let me see. Let me see. Let's see. Let's see the loom on this thing. Oh yeah, the numbers and the hands. Now let's spin our friend a little bit because this is an automatic watch. Oh, it's already moving. All right, so I guess the motion we've been doing helps. And here's the back. Yeah, Spinnaker Automatic 50, SP5080 Sapphire Glass. This is a nice watch. That's a nice watch. In my opinion, anyway. I kind of like the Spinnakers. I have a... This is my third? Is it my third? Yeah. I have an automatic, and I have a quartz, and this is my second automatic. Now, let's see if this is a screw-down crown. It is. It is a screw-down crown. There. There we go. All right. Now, I'm not setting the time right now, but uh, let's see how it looks on wrist. It's, it's obviously not going to fit because it has extra links, but you get the idea what it looks like on wrist. That's pretty nice. Uh, let's see if you can see the extra links there. It has, I think, two extra links. Maybe, maybe one if I. Okay, there's a little trick, but it only works like half the size of a link. And this one, it actually is almost the full link. Uh, hold on, this had a little extra plastic on it. I just removed it now. So, I showed it to you in a prior video. Moving this adjustment in is about half the size of a link, or a little, maybe a little more. So let's say you're uh, two away from it being straight on the skin, like exact size. I would suggest actually doing one and a half. Oh, this video is almost out of time.